Mark Wahlberg went to his daughter's school dance. So before we get into this, so you can get a feel of who Mark Wahlberg is on the inside, let's take a moment as an excuse to look at Mark Wahlberg's daily routine, which he posted on his Instagram. Hi, in my prompt, where is my sticky? Yeah, I want it. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Typical daily schedule. 2.30 a.m. wake up. Oh. Psychopath. Psychopath. <laughs> At 2.30 a.m. wake up. I'm not coming to work. No, I'm sorry. 2.45 a.m. Unless, Greg, in the control room, you want me to. <laughs> okay. 2.45 a.m. prayer time. 3.15 a.m. breakfast. 3.40 to 5.15 a.m. workout. 5.30 a.m. post-workout meal, 6 a.m. shower, 7.30 a.m. golf, 8 a.m. snack, 9.30 a.m. cryo chamber recovery. I'd rather you just say I'm rich, you know? 10.30 a.m. snack, 11 a.m. family time, meetings, work calls. That's right, family time. You either get it or you don't. Get it together. 11 a.m., 1 p.m. lunch, meetings, work calls at 2. 3, pick up kids at school. 3.30, snack. Workout number 2, 5 p.m. shower. 5.30 p.m. dinner, family time. 7.30 p.m. Mark, love yourself. What the fuck is going on? Anyway, this is an insane person. Who golfs for half an hour? That's two holes. That's two holes. Just say you you putt putt. That's it. I'd rather that. I'd rather that. Also, the amount of showers? Two? <laughs> Only one person is allowed to live like this, and it's Dwayne the Rock Johnson, because we already agreed as a society that there can only be one. Okay? And he has perfect teeth. Have you seen his teeth? Gorgeous. Anywho, he's back to this dance. FYI, Mark has four kids with his wife. Okay, before we get into the dance. So he goes to the dance, but he has four kids. He went to one of the kids' dances, right? He has four kids. His wife, he met because they went, all, he met her at like a club and they had a one night stand and the next day they went to church together. Oh. What did she wear to church? <laughs> Is that not insane? Take me anywhere, but to the house of the Lord. <laughs> Back to the story. <laughs> He goes to the dance, and apparently the songs that they were playing was not censored, so there were F-bombs everywhere, okay? And he went up to the DJ, and he was like, what are you doing? <laughs> what the fuck? So the DJ changed the song or whatever, and his daughter told him, like, please don't embarrass me, but this is un poquito embar. Hello. Like, imagine being this little girl, you know, like, s storming off. You know, I'd be, I would turn red, and I'd storm off because I never miss an opportunity to make a scene, but also, this isn't the only first time, this isn't the first time that he embarrassing, embarrasses his little children's, okay? He's wrapped in front of them. Okay. I'm your 45 year old father and I got a rap and if you keep misbehaving, I'm gonna give you behind a slap. <laughs> mm, and it's called a spanky. And if later on in life, you're gonna thank me. Cause all the advice that I'm giving you is good for you and if not, your butt and behind is gonna be black and blue. Done. All right. Done. <laughs> Done. Kim Reddy was like, Tuffy, are you gonna, are you gonna freestyle? And I was like, no, I'm not a parent. What's that? Stormy is your baby? You're right! Cush roll, glass full, no. I prefer the better things. Bitches with no money act like money isn't everything. I'm having a good time. You just gotta deal with it. I'm the only bitch on YouTube that's doing it. My name is Tuffy. I am not a lefty. I have a pop culture show. I've revealed I used to be a hoe. How's that? Yeah. <sighs> Guys, knees, knees weak, arm spaghetti. Okay, so <laughs> the rapping is a lot. Everything else, that's big MJ energy, and that's what we call my mother, Maria Jose Vanegas Pessoa. And like, she was very, very strict when I was growing up. I wasn't allowed to watch Titanic till I was 15. It came out in 1997. I wasn't allowed to watch that till 2005, and I already knew it was already happening. I didn't get to experience that with everybody else. And then I found out it's because she shows a nipple, and I have two of them, so I don't understand what the problem was. I wasn't allowed to watch MTV at all until I was 15. So when like um, the real world was happening, I just had to go. Like this. Yeah, that was crazy. That was super crazy. Uh -huh. I had no idea what was happening. Um, 
Every time a friend picked me up, she would ask for their license and look at it like an officer. Oh, yes. And then one day she was like, if you, I smoked a little bit of weed one time, a little bit of weed. And she <laughs> was like, if you skip class, if you skip class and keep up with these shenanigans, I'm going to withdraw you from your high school and take you to a, a, a private art school. And I did it one more time. And she went in that day, withdrew me, and I finished the day at another fucking school. Wow. Savagery. So, Mark, you're a strict parent, too, you know? And if you're ever wondering, like, am I doing the right thing? I think you're doing a great job. I mean, look how I turned out. <laughs> oh, you like that? That's my show, weekdays, live, 12.30 p.m.